Welcome to Sarah's Enclosure Part 2. If you haven't seen Part 1, I suggest you go and take a look at that, otherwise you have no idea what I'm talking about. Um, we created the enclosure over the weekend, so I have recorded that before this, so everything's in the wrong order. But that's okay. So we're going to pop off of that now. We'll watch that, and then when we come back, I'll then show you how the enclosure is now looking, with Sarah sitting in the eggs, completed and happy. See you in a bit. Day two, we're going to finish off where we left off, uh, which is finishing off the feet. Not really the feet, the runners so that the ducks and things can walk up. Um, I will show you what they look like. Here's one I made earlier. And here's the other one. So they're going to be going in a I don't like a staircase type thing, I feel like that. Okay, so I'm experimenting here. Not sure if it's going to work, but we are going for not sure, not hooks. Sure where the metal box, the metal tool cases that's got hole cutters in. Oh wait, what? Distractions, hooks, and eyes. How close can I get before I lose it on a GoPro? There you go, eyes. So the idea is this hook goes on here and fits into here and they hang in place. That's the theory. It should allow me to take it down if I need to. Or when I need to, because I will need to take it down. So here we go. Quite going to plan. 
So now we have a problem. This is the enclosure. It all looks nice, nice, nice. Problem is Sarah has left her eggs and has gone back to her old box uh, where she's sitting on somebody else's eggs, but they're not fertile eggs. And her fertile eggs are in there. And if I go anywhere near her to put her back on her eggs, she wants to attack me. So yeah, but I'm gonna have to get her in there because otherwise those eggs are not gonna survive. So here we go, wish me luck. So unfortunately, that's not the best news ever to find Sarah's been sitting on the wrong eggs for the, for the entirety of the day. Uh, well, we don't know if it's the entirety of the day, but it's likely. So we just gotta really, really hope that those eggs will survive. There we go. I will keep you posted.